it long, and it's saved by McWilliams. Ejim inside. Ejim flashing inside. She's got the ball. Two more. Four, three. I wasn't quite sure how they were going to come out and respond. Um, offensively, they have responded well. Kaylin bounce, no look. Ejim, two more. On the shot clock. Nice stop. The spin shot is off by Tucker. She got a green. Too hard. Kaylin with the offensive rebound did not hit glass or a rim. Doesn't matter. With the size advantage inside, here's the feed. Falls off the rim. Ejim. Barry inside. Got to connect those if you want to win. Ejim, great catch. Run on the floor, Yvonne. Corey Harris. Ejim steps in front of it. And the lay in at the other end. Be one of the standards. And the, the standard on the West Coast. That shot from Kaylin won't go, but another. Fire one up. And good defense in the half court set by the Zags. Walker looking ahead to Egypt. What a move from one of the bad boys of the Pistons back in the late 80s. Walker no on the three ball attempt, but there's Egypt to clean it up with the Banford eighth seeded Kansas. As Egypt. Kalen Prong gives it to Ejim in stride. I think 60% from beyond the arc in this first half. Partially blocked into the hands of Ejim. Count it and to pass the ball up the floor. Both teams struggling down the stretch in this first half. Nebraska having missed their last five Ejim shots. Ejim low down, run some offense, get a good paint touch. Easy play. Down low. Into the iron, another board. This time she won't be post from the top down. They're very effective with that. Lots of length. Williams to E. Jim. Off the glass and in. Talk about Lisa putting the stuff on. I guarantee you Molly put the stuff on <laughs> and school some people. Still, no question in my mind. E. Jim left wide open. Percent themselves. So it's right. been it's been a defensive battle, and it's low scoring. It looks just like that first meeting. E. Jim drops it in. And we'll see how the fourth quarter plays out. And she remains on the bench. E. Jim up in area of Gonzaga's threes tonight. She's camping out in the corner, thinking about hitting the fourth. E. Jim up for two. Per game, 10 points per game. And no doubt they've had big games, but right now struggling offensively at 19% as a team. Gonzalez, strong hand, BYU, box out. They did have 14 defensive rebounds, and then the assist to turnover ratio. Right where you want it if you're BYU. I think they can get that up on the boards, which has been more crucial than scoring, as you mentioned. Everybody else scoring, she doesn't need to, but nine boards for Gustin. Fair point as Egypt muscles it.